Well, guys, so uh, at this time I'm not sure about really what's happening. Okay. Um, well, uh, yesterday I posted uh, a new video on situation in. Well, it's it's you know the stuff that I post online. It's it's really sensitive, and it is related to abductions, torture, of white U.S. EU citizen. That's basically myself. For the, which I actually even have proofs. That's pretty damn bad. Audio recorded threats of the US government even threatened me to kill me if I don't leave the US all kinds of stuff that I post and you know guys you know I just wondered uh, by the way today is September the 10th of 2017 you know I just I just wonder about something guys you know I slept really 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 poorly tonight and this kind of a stuff was happening to me throughout my stay here in Slovenia however when I left from Slovenia to Hungary that was on February the 14th I think then I came back about two months ago uh, from Hungary, as you know, went uh, through Europe, through Eastern Europe, to Belarus. I have not experienced any of that stuff that I am experiencing here in Slovenia. So, I'm not really sure about what's happening now. Because maybe you guys know, maybe you guys can advise me about this, okay? But the bottom line is, uh, it started again upon my return back to Slovenia and I see the guy here who posted this comment here okay I did not sleep maybe not even four hours tonight uh, the thing is that I'm not myself uh, my mom did not sleep either uh, my my father slept very poorly as well we didn't get much sleep at all. Me, uh, when I woke up this morning, I was like somebody bit me up. My mom barely climbed out of her bed. Um, she's saying she had a cold. That's funny because really I don't see any cold that she would have. Fever, yes, but I don't have a cold. My father doesn't have cold. In a little bit, I'm going to play you a clip. Uh, the three of us are whacked. And it came out of blue, out of like nowhere. Across the night, let's put it this way. Okay, so uh, I don't know. Uh, it's yesterday that I did post this uh, beautiful video about Ukraine about the Poroshenko, you know, what experience it was for me to file for political asylum there. And I did mention quite a few issues with US, with European Union, human rights courts and stuff like that. Uh, pretty sensitive stuff to the governments, I would say. And so, I don't know, is this guy here, guys, in your opinion, is this, is this pretty much what I believed? Uh, the case is because at first you know 
uh, based, I have answered him based, you know, he's asking me here if I, uh, if I get hit with direct energy weapons, microwaves, and so on, uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, but he doesn't post one video about himself or anything like this. And the videos that he have on his channel, uh, it looks like a bunch of paranoids that he liked. Uh, and it's like, you know, he would, that's what I assumed the guy would bully me, you know, like. Oh, my internet connection dropped down too. Look at that. All of a sudden the internet got disconnected. So, well, um, and now the internet is back again. Well, this is interesting because every time I do, uh, things like this are happening. And I have suggested already the, the surveillance my computer somehow. They listen to the stuff that I say, uh, you know. And so the stuff that he have here to me, this, this looks more to me like paranoia. But considering the facts about my mom, about myself, about my father, what happened last night, uh, I no longer think that this is just a, just a regular bully, you know, that he would go and ask me if I get ever, you know, targeted with uh, direct weapons, uh, energy weapons, such as, you know, microwaves and so on. Um, it's strange. You know, the whole house, the three of us live in this household, in this house, uh, whacked tonight. So, you know, I'm just saying, um, I'm just saying because I did came across this stuff here. And, you know, I'm just saying, is it possible? Uh, is there, I don't know about these guys. I did not even have time to research it. So I was just gonna ask you, do you guys think it's actually possible for the U.S. government? Hmm. Uh, that they actually could use uh, something like this. Uh, you know, shoot something from the space onto foreign soil. You think that there is such technology that can do that? I did not go through any of this. I did not even research, I did not bother with any of this stuff yet, I will. And, you know, I'm just saying, I'm not, I'm not saying that this is what happened. Uh, you know, I'm just saying that the three of us today are whacked. I'm gonna put it this way, okay? So, I'm just saying, I'm just asking, if you guys maybe know anything about this stuff, uh, all right. Uh, thanks for watching this video till next time. And please let me know if you do know something about stuff like that. Okay. Something that I have to research about as, um, yeah, I am in Slovenia. Uh, that's in Europe. That's close to Italy, Austria, Hungary, Hungary, and the South we have Croatia. And, uh, to me, uh, it's this few coincidences, you know, that somebody comes and he posts the comment like this that he posts the comment like this uh, to me and the three of us you know we feel whacked um, you know I would just like to know I mean you know, if there's a possibility, is there a chance that that actually could be happening as well? So, interesting how my internet got disconnected and stuff. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to say. The, this is the game that, uh, you know, they, they totally have in their hands. Uh, that's all. Thanks for watching this video. Till next time. Well, this basically is to uh, to finish this recording, and it will be the best, the easiest way for me to just, uh, you know, submit the proofs about my claims to you through uh, audio recording. Uh, also, it was much worse. Uh, like I said, my mom barely climbed out of the bed. Yes, she's old, uh, but this is just really not the usual uh, case with her. And, uh, you know, it just really... Me, my back... 
hurt. Uh, it felt like, I don't know if I would be, I, I don't actually have an explanation for this stuff, how that exactly felt. It's like, you're being like really, really severely tired. Okay. Uh, and the same case was with my mom. My mom, no, she, she barely climbed out of the bed. And also I would mention my, my fingers they swallowed and it hurt everything hurt like i had a swollen finger i thought the finger is gonna like it, it's like it was like numb like painful like like i really can't explain that uh also it did happen in the past when in slovenia uh but it never happened when i went abroad i should say when i went to hungary uh, across the Eastern Europe and when I was in Russia, I did not have any of this happening. So I'm just saying, I don't really know what the situation is. Uh, but to me, this is just, I'm going to say this is weird to me. Okay, let me, uh, let me go on and play the clip. Uh, first, the mom. <laughs> My mom would never uh, complain. She does not complain, but she's saying, I asked her, uh, I thought you said you're not feeling well. And she says, uh, I'm really not. Um, I did miss the recording in the morning when she was in the living room. She was in the bed. Uh, and she, it, it looked like she's going to die out. I mean, literally. And that really prompted me because of what I have experienced tonight, uh, to think a little bit said, man, this is, this is two of us just across the night like this. I mean, just, I'm just saying, I'm not saying anything. Listen, I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying, if you guys know anything about this, if anything like this is possible, uh, you know, please let me know. All right, then let's go to my father now. Okay, I, I asked my dad here, I asked him, good morning, I said, how did you sleep this morning? And uh, uh, he says, so-so, and I say, I reply to him, uh, not too good, huh? Uh, okay, let's see a little further. Oh yeah, when he was holding a cup, a teacup, his hand was shaking. Uh, but my father is very sensitive to that. He, uh, he is, he fears like anything you would say. And so does mom, you know, everything you would say to them, something like, God forbid, I would indicate to them the stuff I'm talking about right now. I mean, uh, but I did observe that stuff. And so this, this is just really weird. Okay. Let's, let's continue with this recording. Okay, so I'm saying to him, look, I said, Dad, I'm just asking you because nor mom and nor I slept well tonight. So I asked him, I said, uh, Dad, did you, you know, I just, I'm just, you know, like trying to get a little more information about him so he can maybe describe me a little bit how, you know, how exactly he feels, you know. And so I asked him, I say, uh, 
so you know I, I i pretend like like if it's everything is okay you know with smile on my face i asked him i said so that you you slept well it's like uh, you slept like you regularly do like normally you sleep and he says to me no he says worse than my regular sleep it was uh, and i and i reply to him i say a little worse really and i ask him i go further and i said uh, that did you sleep a whole a lot worse than what you regularly sleep and like i told you guys uh my father is afraid of um you know saying anything any stuff like that um i guess he doesn't want to be rated as paranoid schizophrenic the way they have rated me and nor mom does and so he gets an excuse for himself and he says he he blames the weather for it he's saying that weather is turning for worse as he's saying so i asked him i said dad i said so you think this is because of the weather and he says yeah yeah and i say to him no dad i think that's because of something else but i don't discuss i just go my way basically all i need is the proof that this actually you know it's just the case i'm not saying like i'm not saying anything that i'm a victim of direct weapon from the space of the u.s government all i'm saying is that if you guys know anything about this stuff uh most definitely if anybody in this world would be targeted if there is a, such a weapon if that actually exists that definitely that would be me myself before everybody i should say anybody else let's put it this way okay i think i did cost u.s government substantial amount of damage by revealing uh you know the truth about what is happening in the u.s with our white people stuff that took place against me so i don't think anybody ever did like this uh anybody actually submitted recorded audio proofs and stuff like that i did uh, i know they don't like me uh they don't like me a whole lot they don't like me so i'm just saying if you guys know any uh anything about this if it's possible please let me know all right thanks Será que você não pode outras obras? Thank you. 